So here we got this uh, set of tuples that is formed by they have this form x0 and x is a real number greater than zero, greater or equal than zero. So we need to show if it is or is not a vector space. So in this case, first uh, I need to define the neutral element for the summation. So we're going to use the here this space is equipped with the usual summation of uh, of vectors that means element by element and the usual scalar multiplication that the scalar multiplied to each of the elements of the vector space okay so that just to clarify what's happening here so let's define uh, with respect to the summation the neutral element that means taking into consideration the fourth uh, axiom that say that it exists a neutral element on the possible vector space on the vector space in this case such that if i pick another vector u on the vector space u plus the neutral element is equals to u Okay, so this should be satisfied. In this case, it is trivial that given a, ve uh, uh, a generic vector u equals to u1, 0, this is part of b, then u plus the 0, 0 vector returns u. Because this is equivalent to having u1, 0, plus 0, 0, and this is just u1 0 this is equals to u1 0 so is the same vector so the uh, the neutral element is equals to the zero vector okay so this is important you may ask why I'm not proving the first and the second, the second and the third axiom. Well, that is because in this case, this is not a vector space. So I'm going to show which axiom it contradicts. But for that, I need the neutral element. Okay. So let's continue. We got define the neutral element on this space is zero, zero. And what happened is that this vector space doesn't hold the fifth axiom why let's consider a generic vector u u1 0 in this space and what the fifth axiom say that it exists the inverse of this denoted by minus u that should satisfy that u plus minus u is equals to the null vector so let's find this minus u. In this case is u1, 0, and plus alpha 1, 0. I'm going to determine the value of alpha 1 equals to the 0 vector. OK? You can see that this is part of the vector space B if and only if alpha 1 is greater or equal than 0. So what happened is that we need to show that alpha 1 plus u1 is equals to 0. But this is equivalent to say that alpha 1 is equals to minus u. But the problem here is that u1 is greater or equal than 0. That means a positive number. And alpha 1 is also a positive number. So the only possibility that this equality holds is for alpha 1 equals to u1 equals to 0. But that means that it doesn't hold generically. For every vector u1, we should find an inverse of that. And in this case, that is doesn't satisfy. So here we find a contradiction. And that means that this space V 
is not a vector space.